All right, guys, excited to bust into some new Sapphire baseball. So the first series they did this was way back, probably way back at the beginning of last of 2019. Maybe maybe early spring, March, something like that. And, uh, and then they just released Series 2. And uh, I was able to scoop up three boxes kind of at the last minute before they sold out. So uh, this is Series 2. There's 100 in this series. This is box number 14 out of 100. So you've got three autographed baseballs in each box. And um, some of the big names include Mike Trout. You've got uh, Vlad Jr. is in this. I think Pete Alonzo. Um, Aaron Judge has been in this in the past. So some huge, huge names that we can find, including you've got uh, the black leather baseballs. You've got 24 karat baseballs. Uh, so hopefully we can pull something really nasty out of here. So this is going to be a random team break. So every spot in the break gives you three random teams. So 10 spots all together. So in break number one, I've got Todd in with two spots. I've got Keith uh, with one, Rick in with three, Brian W's got one, Matthew B with one, Joe in with one, and then Tony picked up the last spot in this one. So let's go ahead and randomize the teams. Yeah, man, we're doing, we do some non eBay stuff every week. So we'll try to get you, if you guys are not getting our weekly email that goes out each Friday, um, we'll get you added to that. If there's a specific email you want, want it sent to, let me know. Sometimes it can get trapped up in spam filters and stuff like that. But it goes out every Friday. So I want to make sure that you guys, that, that'll keep you up to date. That way you don't have to worry about any breaks filling up before you can grab spots. So you can just uh, claim them right away. A lot of fun stuff we're breaking each each weekend. You suck. All right, let's go ahead and randomize the guys in this. Every spot's going to give you three random teams. All right, so we'll mix this up five times as well. All right, so here is the list of teams. So Brian W., you got the Angels, the Rangers, and the Dodgers. Uh, Joe, you've got the Diamondbacks, the Phillies, and the Royals. Keith has got the Indians, the Rockies, and the Yankees. Uh, Matthew B. with the Twins, Pirates, and Braves. Rick, you've got the Padres, the Mets, the Mariners, the Marlins, the Rays, the Cubs, the Nationals, the Astros, and the Tigers. Uh, Todd's got the Brewers, White Sox, Blue Jays, Reds, Orioles, and Giants. And then, Tony, you've got the Red Sox, the A's, and the Cardinals. All right, so real quick, just to make sure, unless the team is listed on the baseball in some kind of inscription, um, or let's say, for example, it says, you know, inscribe Rookie of the Year and, and list a, a specific year. Um, so if, if that happens, it's going to go to whatever team is listed on the baseball or whatever team that person played for in the year that they won the award. All right. So if it doesn't list any of that, if it's just got a, 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 a signature on it, then it's going to be based on length of service. So Ken Griffey Jr., for example, um, he went into, uh, the only thing that would trump that would be the Hall of Fame. So it's what team they went into the Hall of Fame with or what team they play, he played for the longest. All right. So that's what that's what we're going to use to determine that. So just want to make sure that that uh, is all cleared up. No confusion on that. All right. So let's bust into this. So box number 14 out of 100. So we got a little seal here in addition to the uh, shrink wrap. Alright, bro, they got 
three uh, three baseballs. Uh, all of them are black leather, and um, one has got an envelope here, which that's got to be that's going to be some good news. There must be something nasty in here. So first name, I already see that it's a good one. See if I can get this thing to. There you go. It's going to be an Anthony Rizzo. So it is Fanatic certified, which that may be what's in the envelope there. And MLB authenticated. Nice blue auto on that. Yeah, so Carlton Fisk going to go to the Red Sox because that's what team he went into the Hall of Fame with. So it's going to be based on Hall of Fame. Anthony Rizzo, that's an easy one. It's going to be the Cubbies. So the Cubs on that is going to be Rick M. So Rick, nice pull for you on that. All right, number two. Former Met manager, but Yankee all-star Willie Randolph. So it is JSA certified, so C of A is right next to it. Two-time World Series champ. Six-time all-star is also inscribed on it. I think he played his whole career with the Yankees. Let's double check. Not his whole career, but most of it. So that's a definite Yankee there. He at least got my Mets to a NLCS. All right, and then the last one. I honestly don't know what team this is going to be with. It's going to be a Joe Musgrove. Can we get this thing to? Dude, that's jacked, man. What was the, was there something inscribed? Did he inscribe something that made it White Sox? I wonder what reasoning they used. I don't even know how in the world that's Joe Musgrove. Looks like he just scribbled a bunch of Ys on there. But it's got 17 World Series champs, which means it's going to be what team he won the World Series with in 17. So PSA DNA certified, which is going to be the cheating Astros, isn't it? It's always easier when it's the length of service and the team he, he inscribed. So in this case, two years with Houston, two years with Pittsburgh. But in 17, he played with Houston. So that's going to be the Astros. So we got the Cubs, which is Rick. We got the Yankees, which is Keith. And then the Astros is going to be Rick as well. So Rick grabbing two of the three baseballs in this one. And I guess this is going to be the Fanatics. Yeah, it's going to be the Fanatics C of A there. That'll go with the Anthony Rizzo baseball. All right, so that'll do it for the first Sapphire baseball break. So we'll get those baseballs in the mail to you guys tomorrow. And uh, if we can fill up break number two tonight, that one's gonna come up here in just a little bit.